dear all students today i am again in front of you for our next video for fifth standard maths and today we'll start with our new lesson dear student our first lesson roman numerals i hope you don't have any clue let us start today with a full energy lesson number 2 that is a number verb which is the basic heart of maths dear students you can give a watch on blackboard i wrote here two columns which shows us basic numerals 0 to 9 with the help of this basic numerals 0 to 9 numbers it's possible to prepare any mathematical number and this mathematical number can be read in devanagari numerals way also as well as in international numerals number way also these all numbers also possible to write in word also these all numbers are useful to us in our day to day life also for example if you are going in a shop to purchase something and after purchasing few things that shopkeeper is giving you bill that how much you have to pay to him that bill indicates the number word anywhere you can go to sell and purchase anything to complete our day to day need everywhere we have to pay to each other the money transaction work is completed with the help of number system so very important in your educational life to know about this number work you must know international numerals as well as devanagari numerals you may say miss we are english medium student why we want this marathi uh, numbers writing no student yes you required that i will give you a simple example suppose in future you are a very good doctor and you are brilliant in english language your one patient came from village area and that patient did not know marathi uh, that patient did not know english if you want to say to that patient how much bill is there of your uh, checking and medicine that time you must know devanagari numerals to explain to that patient otherwise you will say the bill in english and the patient will not understand that that time there may be confusion to the both side to avoid this dear students you all must know both the language even though you are english medium students and same examples can happen vice versa that's why students it's very important to know both the way for making international numerals and devanagari numerals of any digit may be one digit two digit three digit four digit five digit six digit etc we must know basic 0 to 9 numbers and you must familiar with these numbers from your junior kg but let's one more look on the basic chart this chart you have to write on your notebook first page as it is as a short note purpose it's compulsory to write see i wrote already on board devanagari numerals means marathi numbers how to write them and how to read them and international numerals means english numbers 0 to 9 and what are the spellings the spellings i gave because these are useful spellings for us for a head teacher already you know yeah. this number start devanagari from shunya shunya in english is called as a zero ek is called one don two teen three char four paanch five sah six sat seven aat eight and no nine so these are equivalent devanagari numerals and international numerals with the help of these basic 0 to 9 numbers we can create 
any digit maths number. So let us start with our actual work. After few minutes, I will show one more chart which is useful to write the given number, how to read and how to write in word, where to give comma, all things I will explain after few minutes. You have one more look on this current chart and write as a short note. Hey, mommy, who's it is? So student, you may have looked previous chart. One more chart I drawn in front of you. Basically, I'm making you familiar with this chart reading first and then we start with our problem set solving of questions. Because before starting that basic problem set, we must know about this various number system. That is why here I wrote a second chart on board which shows us numerals and how to write them in words. These are the numerals written already in your textbook on the last page, page number 9 of that lesson and the chart is given in the blue color writing. A white chart is there inside the blue. You have to copy that chart as it is from that page. You will attention for understanding here. This is number 1. So we wrote here spelling of 1. When we add one zero on that one to the right side, to ahead, not previous. How many zeros you are adding to the left hand side have no meaning. The number remain one only. So, no meaning to the left side zeros in the number system. But the same zero, one one zero, if you add to the right hand side of the number or ahead to the number, the value of that number definitely increase. Here no effect on the value if you add 0 before any number system. So remember always this rule of maths for number work dear students. 1. If you add 1 0 to 1 that become 10. If you add 2 0 to number 1 that become 100. 3 0 that become 1000. 4 0 that become 10,000. From this 1,000, you may observe, I give comma here. So this comma system already we learn in primary section also. It make us easy to read that number. So after three digit from the left hand side, eight, you have to count three digit first. One, two, three. And then you have to give comma. Each number, which may be five digit number or four digit number while giving comma, when you start with right hand side, you have to give after three digit comma. That comma is very useful to us to write that place value. So this comma indicates the splitting of the number in 1000. And after that splitting will be increased by two, two digit. Three, two, 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 like this way till Abja we will reach. This number, one, two, three, comma, 10. So it is 10,000, 10,000, one, two, three, comma, one, two, comma. After this two, two, we have to carry it's one lakh, one, two, three, four, five, six, zero, and one, ten lakh, one crore, ten crore, and one object. These are the numbers. So have a look, write this chart also as a short note in your notebook. Start with problem set 2, question number 1. Question number 1 is there using the digit 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. By using this basic maths digit, write down 10 each of 2 digit number, 3 digit number, 4 digit number, and 5 digit number. So we have to write very simple way any combination of that number. You know the number system, how to read that number from 0 to 100. And in this number system, we have to write two digit 10 numbers. So we may start with any 10 numbers. Your two digit numbers start from number 10. 10 11, number till 99. 10 till 99. Your wish, your choice, any 10 numbers you can write as a two digit number. Two digit number have only two places, unique place and tens place. So I may write any number, this is your choice. You also write any number and try to read them. So like this way, you 
can write any two digit number by using mm. this basic 0 to 9 digit numerate them 11 15 21 33 44 54 68 79 89 90 like this way any sequence or any middle number also you can follow for that it is not the only a perfect answer this only given this also correct if you write your own choice 10 number that also correct so you complete when this exercise in your notebook hope so you will write the that much digit number by your own way i wish to see your notebook for checking purpose if you wrote answer by your own way that is more important important is to understand concept it is not important the number should be this only i again repeat you can write your own numbers three digit number same way now we have to write three digit number so you can use from 100 till 999 from 100 to 999 any three digit number you can write out of that 10 numbers you have to write here for example I wrote here 1, 1, 1 that become this 3 digit number. You may write 215, 360, 405, 672, 792 and we are splitting this each number by using this comma that is a separation of the numbers. This comma indicates separation of that numbers. Maybe for 4 digit and 5 digit, not to confuse between two numbers, proper space should be there in your answers. So here you have to write like this way any types of numbers. Hope so. You are able to write this 4 digit number. So let's give this form of work. So you will complete this way 10 numbers with the help of 4 digit. And 10 numbers with the help of 5 5 digit. One example I will just show here 2345. Suppose you are writing this first number, give here 1, 2, 3 after 3 digit comma. And what is the reading of this number? 2345. This become one four digit number. One four digit number. Like this way ahead when you are writing, you have to give this another comma which is used to separate the two numbers when you are writing in sequence or you may write in a sequence properly that is giving by number to them one number second number third number four number five number and then the answer anyway your choice five digit number i will show one digit to you 22546 suppose then one two three comma and you have to read this number as 2546. Here it's a unit place, tens place, hundred place, and these are the thousand place, ten thousand place. So thousand place, twenty two thousand five hundred forty six. Split the number and read the number. Like this way, I will give homework for these two four digit ten numbers and five digit. 10 number. I want in your notebook answer of this question. You may follow your own way also. So have a look one more time on the board and let's ready for the next question. So understand we are all this all system. I hope you are able to prepare any digit number with the help of basic 0 to 9 digit. Today for your homework I already told you to write that two chart. You Go previous to the video and see the first chart on board. Write that second chart also as a short note and give heading set to and write the answer of this question uh, with your own way. As well as dear student, today's one more homework I will give for you. That is assignment which is based on your primary section knowledge. Just let me check your knowledge first before starting the number system ahead work. You all will write down today as a homework number 0 to 100. Number 1 to 100 in number and dash in word. So your homework is write down numbers from 1 to 100 in a sequence. Make 10, 10 numbers sequence 
1 to 10, the spelling 11 to 20, the spelling like this way you complete till 100 and complete assignment on time. Very soon I will be in front of you for the second part of the first uh, exercise. Second question will start with a new video. Thank you. Have a nice day. Take care. Remain safe with your family. Wash your hand frequently. Have a nice day.